this is Lake Street and this is the elementary school that Elvis attended it's now called Lohan Elementary at the time Elvis uh, attended this school it was East Tupelo Consolidated School it says there he attended school here in 1945 while in the fifth grade one of his teachers Mrs JC Grimes encouraged him to take part in the daily chapel services and Elvis would often sing Old Chef for the class so yes Mrs Alita Grimes was a strong supporter of Elvis and Elvis would often come back here even after he was even after he'd made her as a singer, he'd come back to visit Mrs. Grimes. She encouraged his singing. He was a pupil at the school when he entered the Mississippi Alabama um, Fair and Dairy Show. On October 3rd, 1945, as a 10-year-old, he entered um, singing a song. Inevitably, it was Old Shep. Uh, he was unaccompanied uh, and he came in fifth, believe it or not. And de depending on which story is true, Elvis attended the school from September 41 until uh, summer of 46. Julian Riley contests that uh, Elvis probably attended Ledyard School at, at, in the first grade over in downtown um, Tupelo. Of course, although the Presleys had moved over south Tupelo, um, by around the time Elvis was uh, starting school, they may have moved back over here to East Tupelo, where they lived in several different locations close to the birthplace. But the main consensus is that it was this and only this school that Elvis attended till he, um, till he enrolled in Milam Junior High School. Local historian Julian Riley argues that um, in September 41 when Elvis started school, uh, when Elvis started school, there was a school here in this location here called Ledyard School. Um, and Julian Riley argues that, in fact, Elvis started school here rather than over in the East Tupelo Consolidated School, which is now Lohan School, over in East Tupelo. It's, it's a good argument, being as Prezi family more than likely were living over here at the time. This would be, obviously, within walking distance, both of the school for Elvis here and for the Tupelo Garment Factory, just just beyond that building there for Gladys to go to work. Um, I couldn't find anything. I did find a, a Tupelo uh, like a, um, application for historic status and it was listing all parts of uh, downtown Tupelo and it did say that this area with Ledyard School, um, as far as they knew, uh, was still still had students to at least 1940 so that at least 1940 but could could suggest that it wasn't a school any longer in 1941 when Elvis did start school there is no documentation that I'm aware of that he did come here to school um, and another supporting argument for Elvis starting over in East Tupelo even though he may have been living here at the time uh, was the fact that Noah, his uncle Noah Presley, was the school bus driver um, and it could well have been that Elvis was bussed back and forth to school from this area. So, they said it's Ledyard School, it's not commonly mentioned anywhere as being the school Elvis attended and don't really know if he actually did attend it but it was in this location here that the school once stood. And this is on Broadway and uh, the junction Broadway and Elliot. So here we are, Milam. Milam Junior High School that Elvis attended in the sixth started here in the sixth grade in September of 1946. In July of 46, uh, the Presley family had lost their home on Berry Street over in East Tupelo and had come 
back to downtown living in Mulberry and Commerce before at some time going to 1010 North Green Street. It was September 46 that Elvis entered the sixth grade here. Apparently he'd make, made fun of quite often at the time. Sometimes he'd come to school with no shoes or holes in his clothes. The time he entered the seventh grade in September 47, he was the Presley family were definitely living at 1010 Green Street, North Green Street. And it was around this time that Elvis had started taking the habit of bringing his uh, guitar to school maybe to try and uh, gain favour with his classmates but uh, by all accounts at that time they were completely uninterested in his endeavours and it was in the 8th grade, Elvis started the 8th grade September 48 and it was just a few months, a couple of months before November 48 the family left and uh, moved to Memphis but uh, the classmates to recall he brought his guitar in and sang uh, a song for his classmates um, on that last day in school so uh, that and said so that account would really uh, contradict the stories that the Presley family left in a hurry in the middle of the night so this was the school Milam Junior High <laughs>